All right, we've got one kilometer left, a little less, and the hobbling is now turned into a full on sort of like Hunchback of Notre Dame type thing. You just excited for the last day of walking right now? Yeah. Yeah. Where are you sleeping tonight? At a hotel. In the wilds tonight. On yeah, the beach. Yeah. Beach. Oh, that would be so cool. Uh, I know. So cool. That, well, I can say it wasn't how we slept, but last night was the first night in the entire trip that I was actually hot. <laughs> last day. Last day. People have written books, some have a great look that covers the magazines for kids who are 17. But I don't know what to do. I'm staring into the blue sky and just waiting for a sign. Some, they are certain of what awaits them when it all ends. But I don't know what will happen to me. Will I be remembered? Dust in the wind Or the talk of the town That we are living in Well, I don't know I don't know Day 40 Well, who cares what day it is? It's our last day It's our last day <laughs> It's our last day And we are I'm I don't know I'm, not, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna reflect We're happy, later sad, melancholic um, Elated In pain all of the above. <laughs> and at this point, we can see water. There's, 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 water right there's there. breeze all over the place, even though it's going to get warm today. It's a great hiking day so it's far. It's going to be amazing. I, I, I have nothing but joy for this day. Me too. And, and a too. big pinky blister that is throbbing right now as, <laughs> as I stand We've here. We've decided to just amputate it with his, with his hiking knife. Well, I think that at the end it. of the day, Finisterre has <laughs> magic healing powers for pinky toes. You're going to step toes. into the water and, and it's, it's just all going to wash away. I know. I know. I'm, I'm so ready for that. And then if it doesn't work, then maybe I just right. chuck the toe. How far are we going today? F 15? 16K. 16? And we're going to go all the way down to the marker that says zero, which is going to be really cool. Well, Russ, we don't um, finish. Or we don't finish, right? right? Right. And I think it's, I don't know, so, I think it's, I have lots of optimism and positive thoughts for the day today. So barring some unforsaken issue, like like a pinky that falls off, <laughs> um, we're finishing today. And it's, so far, there are no, there's no one out here. We've had five people pass us, there's come another one coming now. I just don't think many people come this way and it's been really great, I think, from a kind of a peaceful cool down process for us to just kind of hang as so, a family. So we're ready to finish. Now. In Finisterre. Now. In Finisterre. Finisterre. Finish in Finisterre. Yes. Let's go. Let's go. Final day of the Camino, you guys have discovered the ultimate baggage carrying system. <laughs> How do you guys feel about yourself? Great, actually. I saw this on a photo on our book and I was like, no way we'll do that. We should have done that in the Maceta. We should have. We should mark it that way. A stick. Buy a stick. $100. Premium stick. High tech. Very, very strong. Value a 
adorable. And cheek sticks. I know. Day 44. Finally. Welcome to Camino News Network. Our last day. We are live with Jessica, Avalon, and Will today. We are interviewing them for the last time. Ooh. Is it sad that you are leaving Camino, Mom? I'm very sad. I'm very, very sad. How about you? I don't think anyone in the world is happier than me right now. Will. <laughs> I am just, I'm ready to put my feet in the salt water. They, they need them badly. <laughs> Your Epsom salt foot bath? Yes. Let's see, how about you? Uh, it's a bit of both. I'm kind of happy and I'm kind of sad. <laughs> I'm happy that we'll be back and you won't have to get up at 5.30 every morning. <laughs> I'm happy about that too. And I'm sad that we won't get movies every day. Mm. <laughs> anyway, aches and pains. How do I feel? I have no aches and pains. I want to be honest, my feet still hurt. Not because of blisters, they just ache. And I thought at this point, 44 days in, my feet would not hurt at all. But my neck has never felt better. And I'm really happy about that because I was going to have surgery in November on it. And I think I may cancel it. So I'm happy about that. But no, that was going to be our daddy daughter weekend. <laughs> Because Lago's going to Antarctica. Ooh, ooh. I can I can stay in a hotel for the week. That's fine. How I, are you feeling? My body is really tired too, and my left knee hurts a little, but otherwise I'm good. William. It doesn't really matter. We're done today. <laughs> I'm not. Tell us about tell us about your pinky toe, Will. It doesn't matter. He has a blister. We're done today. The size of his big toe on his pinky toe. It's ugly. And don't watch this while you're eating. <laughs> <laughs> And also, today is the last day of our community. Woo! So, if you're expecting more CNN, it will be RVNN. <laughs> I love that. Wait a minute, how'd you sleep? I slept perfect. Log how about you? Um, I slept great until Largo started sleepwalking um, all over the albergue and I had to follow him around into the kitchen. <laughs> Same here. <laughs> well, how did you sleep? I slept fine. <laughs> So That's get it for Camino News Network. I hope you have enjoyed this network. And goodbye. Thank you. Drop this mic. Where are we, Largo? We're right. Wait, give me a sec. We're right here. We're going here. Which is what? How far away? Like, I don't know. 90. 90. We are now at the 10 kilometer mark and we are ignoring all signs, all warning signs of any type of pain, discomfort. There's songs being sung. There is joviality everywhere. There's people actually walking the other way, walking past from Finisteo going back to Santiago. We, we won't be doing that. I've never really been the one who's worried. Always been the one who's keeping it cool. The kind of guy you chill while others hurry. We are at the 10K mark and there is no pain. There is no discomfort. There is no differences of opinion. Usually by this hour there's a slight difference of opinion, especially among the kids. But everyone's just like happy and joyful. And my little blister on my pinky toe is Awful. You cannot talk However, about the blister. This no, whole I'm not talking about it. No but one listen, wants to hear that. Listen, all I want to talk about as far as the blister is that <laughs> we would normally not have this type of discomfort. And everyone we're walking with who's walked a significant amount of distance usually at this point has nothing. Except for us because we killed ourselves on the day of Santiago. You just have a weak, weak pinky toe. It's I do have a weak to pinky it. toe. <laughs> all right, enough, enough, enough. Move the weak link. All I'm trying to say is for those people looking to do the Santiago to finish there. Um, normally you would not have new ailments come up. We were just... Think, I would think not, but because we did that 42K into Santiago, they were, we had ailments that were already kind of irritated. They just didn't have time to heal. They just went full blown. So, yeah. so it doesn't matter. We're happy. Less than 10K to go now. No more pinky toe talk. No more pinky toe talk. You hear that? Yes. I think the thumbnail for this vlog should be your pinky toe blister. I don't think so. <laughs> Can you imagine? Gross. Oh. <laughs>
Do you guys realize that this is the best shape that you've been in the entire um, life that you guys have been in so far? I've been in shape before, I mean. You I what? I used to exercise. There was that time in Costa Rica where I ran for like an hour once. Right, and, and now you've walked the entire northern coast of Spain. No. Well, not the whole coast. It was basically out of Spain. You know? It's okay. It's okay? I mean, I have abs now, and that's cool. Abs of steel. <laughs> And with seven, <laughs> with, and with seven kilometers left, we are, we're like right there, like ocean, like real ocean, like not this, like what we saw in sea, which was really nice because it was salt water, and there was like, you know, it was pretty and everything else, and you knew that we were there, but here, you look, and you look beyond, and then you look beyond, and there's no land, and this is, we're getting really close, guys, we're getting really, really, really super close, guys. Um, hour and a half I guess but I gotta cross these roads Woo! you gotta stay on your game I've seen gladness I've seen sorrow I'll tell you a story of a new tomorrow is quite a circus act here getting really good I can take off my shirt without stopping or taking off my pack it only took me 44 days to master the skill <laughs> 884 kilometers 885 kilometers you there. <laughs> we only got like five left and how many miles was that 500 and something 50 miles around there I would walk 500 miles and I would walk 54 more. Really? And, uh, <laughs> not Was that bad? More. 54 more? Yeah, isn't that what we did? About 550 oh, yeah, yeah, something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, kid, it, kid, keep up with the game. You're going to just arenas. It's been magic, you and I, but summer's gotta end. Listen to that ocean breeze. Feel it sitting under our feet, but somewhere's gotta end. So we're within three, two kilometers, something like that. You see any signs? Nope. No signs? You sure we're on the way? Yep. Is there a way at this point, or we're just now. It'd be terrible to lose our way. Alright, we've got one kilometer left, a little less, and the hobbling is now turned into a full on sort of like Hunchback of Notre Dame type thing. It is. Buen camino. Buen camino. Gracias. To the lighthouse we go. Alright, so this is really exciting. This is the lowest kilometer mark we've seen because we, were, we weren't really paying attention when we were going to Santiago, <gasps> but... It went down to zero, Santiago, or no? It no, didn't. it didn't go down to zero. Yeah. But here, almost we're almost there. We're under, under a kilometer, 300 meters. We are practically here, and there is, this is like a huge tourist attraction. It is. I'm waiting for like a big Ferris wheel I to show up or something like that. I think we need to find a special spot to contemplate life in our journey. As long as they sell wine, I'm okay with that. And salt water for your feet. And salt water for my feet. <laughs> there is apparently like the last stamp we get like right here. Oh, that's right. We get our to get our stamp. We get our stamp to say that we've been to the end of the world. I don't need a stamp to tell me I've been here. You guys, you guys excited? I'm not leaving without a souvenir. I need proof that I did this. You got a vlog that says you did this. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. 
this is awesome. Oh my goodness. Ah, we made it. Success. This is not a joke. This is 0. 0.000 oh kilometers. Gosh. I'm gonna cry. Oh. We made it. 44 days, 890 kilometers. How many blisters? It doesn't matter. How many miles? 500 and like uh, 50 miles. 550 I'm miles. So it doesn't happy. matter. But we have arrived. Now, now we start the how many thousand mile swim? Recovery. Recovery. <laughs> this is it. All right, let's let some other people take some pictures and then I'll yeah. Okay. <laughs> and now Lar Largo's turning to the official photographer of the, the 0, 0.00 mark. Largo, you're doing a great job. You're going to get hired for doing the photos here. One, two, three. Okay, good, good, good. Upon arrival, we have new oh. old friends and new are coming back together. Oh. Look at this. Split in two, hope you're fine Ain't got time To do everything you said you would Frames of the past and The memory of you just come running by Pictures of sunny days With your smile and the bar How could they say I was broken? How could they say you made me come undone? Now I know that it's okay. Unlike my friends, you are nothing like We've just come to the realization during this whole saying hi is that a lot of people actually just check into their uh, bag to check in the hotel and then they'll come here to the lighthouse the next day. I don't know how many people actually come here fresh from the Camino and walk all the way through the last 3K. Um, my feet hurt. Another blister was discovered as I took off my shoes. This is this is exhilarating. Yes. Painful. Certainly. Was it something for the kids to remember for the rest of their lives? I sure do hope so because I know that uh, they've definitely shown that they are capable of so much more than they thought of, and we're we're super grateful that they've done it and done it without complaining. I mean. They were a little snippy, but nothing, nothing, nothing really crazy. So we have just arrived in the hotel and this is what detoxing from all of our bags looks like. Oh my goodness. We have at this point, <laughs> bag here, bag there, bag there, random stuff floating over there. We've got now a whole pile that is set up to go ahead and donate. We have a pile that's set up to burn. Yes, people burn clothes here. And then Illegal. we have, and then after that, we have uh, laundry pile. We have laundry pile and... And then we're going to get our shoes bronzed. And we're, no, we're not getting our shoes bronzed. <laughs> but we're, then we're just basically... We're tired. We got here. And it's over. Oh my goodness. We had a three, three kilometer walk back from the lighthouse. We actually walked back. I walked back in flip-flops. What a difference to walk back in flip-flops this thing is. I, I don't know why I didn't do it more often. I think I would have saved myself a lot of blisters, but nevertheless, we're here. Um, we have to go to the beach next. So we are, we're doing our detox. We're doing our winding up of the Compostela, of the Finisterra, of the entire era, whatever you want to call this thing. And that involves donating our shoes, our sleep sacks, some clothing, ponchos, and, um, and getting, getting that a, last stamp. That last stamp. We're getting another certificate, which will sit in a scroll for, I don't even know, to when. But that's I okay. <laughs> I don't know but it'll doing. sit there with our names on it, and it, it'll be good. It, this is our ponchos, sleep sacks, and hiking boots that we're donating. Goodbye. Oh, they stink. Goodbye. It's been good. <laughs> Onward to other pilgrims. <laughs> Gracias. Nada. Bye. Buen día. Igualmente. <laughs> it's almost kind of sad. <laughs> I feel like we're partying with a child or something. But we have get, we'll get new ones for our next hike. Final stamp. Whoa. Happy birthday, dear Avalon. Happy birthday to you. Think hard. I wish for five more Caminos. <laughs> I don't wish for five more Let me tell you.
you got the time, I'd like to stay a while. Do you remember what I said last time we met? Would you like to move a little closer now? I'd like to be as close to you as I can get. If I could stop the time Avalon, what Whoa. do you think about your birthday? I would rather wash your hands. Spine ops, spine ops. And well, I'm, I had a great birthday. I had a great birthday. Oh. I had a great birthday. Oh. You will remember this great. forever. How happy you were hiking the day before your birthday. <laughs> okay, day 44 and... It's our last day. We're gonna finish there. <laughs> we, we made it. We made it, I can't believe it. We had doubts at times, right? I am now in flip-flops and I am now wearing a new hat. Look at this. I had this I had this in, in the arsenal the entire time because to be truthful, there's a lot of people that wore like baseball hats yeah. and I did not want to wear it at all because it doesn't give you like the full brim coverage. Plus Will's an overpacker. And I'm an overpacker and I had to break it out because I needed to justify <laughs> actually having that inside the kitchen sink. <laughs> there's a few things that did it's not come heavy, out. It's heavy guys, it's like, whoa. I know, <laughs> but there's a few things that didn't come out but this finally came out on the last day. <laughs> so it, it justified, it's, it's being carried all the way through Spain. We made it. I know, I'm super excited. There were times we doubted it really, so. There was a last three it. kilometers that I, I keep saying this over and again. We made it. We made it. How far did we go? We went 16 kilometers. However, we walked back yes. from the lighthouse to our hotel. So all in all, we did 19 kilometers. So bonus miles. I like and those bonus is, miles. This is what we did. We actually walked by our hotel to get to the lighthouse. But Will and I decided we're not going to tell the kids because they're going to want to drop their packs. We're going all the way to the end with our packs. And, and, and we Will did and not I, hear a sound. We didn't hear people because by the time we got back to the hotel, they didn't even realize they were so tired. <laughs> but we were almost having second thoughts about that because that pack got so heavy on those last three kilometers. I know. All but, uphill. But if you are walking the Camino and you are determined like we are to go ahead and walk all the way to the end to the lighthouse, that walk back is actually super easy. It is. It's, it's all, all downhill. downhill. If you change your shoes at the lighthouse and you put on your flip-flops, you feel like you're walking on beach sand oh. and not even carrying a pack. And if it you're is... walking back with okay and reminiscing about the things that you didn't see together, it just it winds up becoming like Right, like this. right, right. It goes really quick. I mean, we're like, we're here? Oh, wow, okay. How, did we break the budget yesterday? I think we probably did. Oh, God, there's no, there's no need to talk there's No, no one cares about, about that now, anymore. right? Okay, budget's gone. We're, we're in celebration mode. So <laughs> budget is, is done at this point. And, and we have one more video for you guys. We have one more, we're gonna record all of our thoughts, our feelings, what we liked, what we did not like, what worked well, what Best didn't work well. Best experiences, what we brought or didn't think we should have brought or things we should have brought. Um, all kind of a mishmash of things that you guys have asked along the way. Right, because... So this is not the end of the Camino. It's so the end of our walking, hiking. It's the end of our walking, but... but it's not the end of our t Camino talk. No, no. But we'll figure out what, what the end of the Camino talk is going to be. We did. I know. <laughs> we did. I, know. I can't believe it. <laughs> Super exciting. Okay. Of all what? that being said, thank you for joining us. Thanks, guys. Thanks for being part of our Camino. Um, we're already brainstorming about what we're going to do next. But yeah. I've got some ideas. It'll be interesting. Okay. Bye. Ciao. Dos cola caos. Um, dos cafe con leches. It's your last cola cow lager. No, this is it. Yes, this is. We're back to like juicing after this. <laughs> back to juicing after the cola cows. Cheers. I miss the juicer. Cheers. <laughs>